Hello, everyone. My name is Mr. Mackler. I'm the athletic director here at GCIT, and this week we'll be honoring our GCIT Male and Female Athletes of the Week. First is our Female Athlete of the Week, Jess Beck of the uh, GCIT Girls Soccer Team. Uh, Jess, congratulations on being honored this week. Last year you, uh, you you broke the school record for goals for 17, and this year you have four. So, you know, what, what are some of your goals for the season? First of all, thank you, Mr. McAleer. Uh, my goals for the season, so we've really come a long way since last year. As a family, we've really grown and come together. And personally, for me and as a team, I'd like to just start winning some games and cashing in because we've really put in the work and it's about time to see some results. Sounds good. How long have you been playing soccer? And Well, you, this is your fourth year on the varsity, but how long have you been playing soccer? Uh, Definitely been playing for as long as I can remember. I guess I remember even playing on the same team as my brother. Our parents would take us to the micro mini soccer, so it's been it's been quite a long time. Uh, it's early in the season. I know we've had a couple injuries, a couple tough you know uh, losses, and we had a tough tie yesterday. You play at the Union game in a couple weeks. That's got to be exciting. Yeah, it is exciting. Everyone's really excited, and I think the thing that's most important to us is that even though we're losing, we're not shutting down. We're coming together closer, and hopefully that'll really help us come out with a win, especially at the Union game. Okay. Well, there she is, Jess Beck, our GCIT Female Athlete of the Week. Hello, we're back again, and we're honoring our Male and Female Athletes of the Week, and the GCIT Male Athlete of the Week is senior Danny Gomes with the boys soccer team. Danny, congratulations. The team is 3-3 uh, three and three right now, so so far so good for the team this year so far? Uh, thanks for uh, honoring me as Athlete of the Week, and we're getting getting close to winning. We're there. We just have to start finishing, and uh, big step from last year. Like we are like a big family this year, as in last year. Like it was the seniors and then and then all the on the classroom, but now like we're all gelling together. We just need to put in the goals. The team's three and three. You started out two and zero. Oh. Um, you had a, a really exciting overtime win against Gloucester Catholic last week. So really, like you said, the team's starting to uh, gel together. It's got to be exciting to watch everybody working hard. Yeah, that big win on against Gloucester Catholic. Um, we uh, went to overtime, and like five minutes in overtime, I crossed it. The goalie was really big, so I told my team I was going to put it on the ground. And we ended up finishing it, and everyone got hype. And it was a great win. This week we lost two times, but uh, on Saturday our tech tournament came. I'm pretty sure we're going to go out there and punish them, like how we got punished this week. Speaking of that, that was the team that knocked us out of the tournament last year in overtime, so a BCIT West Hampton. So that, that's a big game this Saturday. But this year you've got, you had four assists, you, you had a goal yesterday. So, listen, uh, best of luck to you and the rest of the team, and uh, hope we get a, the W this weekend. Danny Gomes, Male Athlete of the Week.